One, two, three. <laughs> At the stroke of midnight, with a ceremonial ribbon cutting, Dunwoody officially became DeKalb County's newest city, a milestone that could have far-reaching implications for the fledgling city and county. It's exciting to officially cut the ribbon, uh, but uh, I think amongst all of us elected officials, it's, it's uh, continue to, to work our buns off to get this thing up and running and to have a successful city. It's been just four months since residents voted overwhelmingly in favor of the plan to form the new city. But while Dunwoody officially came into being December 1st, residents may not notice much difference, at least for the first few months. The city's inked a deal with the county to continue providing fire, 911, water and sewer service, and has plans in the works to start its own police department. Getting our police up and running, that's going to take a little bit more time, and, and we're shooting for uh, March, April time frame, but that's going to be critical, and I think the community and, and us as elected officials see that as a, as a big uh, stepping point for us. In the meantime, DeKalb County will continue to provide police services, although there is some question and wrangling over just how much that's going to cost. From suburb to city, Dunwoody residents excited this morning about the changes and challenges that are sure to come. The moniker that, that would be nice would be the uh, Atlanta's classic city.